So it's interesting that 64% of mobile phone users have played a game in the past 30 days. And in fact, there was a study that was done that actually found that people are more likely to play a game with their phone than even check the weather. So that this can help to improve risk balance. And because what is, is there's an accelerometer that's present in a smartphone. So here's just a couple. Uh, this is actually a patient of mine. One is called Retro Labyrinth. And it's kind of like one of those round mazes that has little balls and he's tilting it back and forth. Now, he, this is early on in his program and he doesn't have good form supination yet. So I'm allowing him to hold the phone to the side, but you can see that his wrist is moving. And then the way to upgrade that would be as he gets better and gets more forearm supination, he would need to hold the phone in the palm of his hand. But for right now, he's able to do that. Then one he's working on now is called Simple Mazes, and it basically has a little star that he's moving back and forth through the phone to try to get it from one point to the other. So again, a dynamic activity that's using and activating the different muscles in his wrist. So the big thing you have to do when you're doing this is tell them they have to keep their elbows stabilized, they should try to keep their forearms stabilized, and do as much as possible just by moving the wrist. Mm -hmm.